everybody it's money saving coupon gal welcome back to my channel if you're new welcome to my channel I have a large Dollar Tree haul here I have video I have pictures I found so many awesome things at this Dollar Tree that I'm so excited to show you guys and actually I have two different hauls but this one here um, I believe this is all I found so many of the new craft items I was just surprised at all they have even the employee said something to me about she was surprised at how many of the craft items they got in so anyways first let's start with this um, broth I got chicken broth and beef flavored broth I get it there it's gluten free it's only a dollar a lot cheaper than Walmart Publix anywhere else so I got one of each of those and then I got the minced garlic also there this is an eight ounce jar for a dollar obviously um, okay let's get into the goodies here I said, well, here are some oldies, but let me start. Here I have the red and green glitter ribbon, and this is 5 eighths by 144 inches, which is 4 yards. I got one of each color of those. They had fabric. There are felt rolls. They also, I think, had fabric. I took pictures of everything I said. And this is um, not the thickest, but it is a nice, and let's see if it tells us, it's 11.75 inches by 48 inches. Now, I just bought some at Joint Fabrics, four squares for a dollar. So, um, but I didn't get black. They had no black. So, I'm glad that I picked this up. And then they have these felt letters. There's 100 pieces in here. And I got the blue. And I think I got, oh, I got red too. And I got these to go on ornaments for their names for our dogs so I got a blue and a red they didn't have pink or so I would have got pink for Bella then here's some of the fabric here's one of them that I got in the stripe I think this is the only one I bought there and this is uh, what's the size let me see if it gives a size on here oh 20 inches by 21 inches and they remind me of the candy cane they had these cute little craft cubes and these are, come on, focus. These are 36 pieces in here, and they're 0.63 inches. I hope this is focusing in because I can't keep redoing videos, especially when they're large like this. Okay, and then I got a white glitter ribbon too, like the red and green. I got this jute. Now these C's Crafter Square are all new craft stuff they're carrying. This is um, a three ply natural jute cord and it is 2.8 ounces. And then I found this metallic marker and it doesn't say what color. It just says fine point acid free. But it doesn't say what color it's in. But anyways, I picked that up. I thought for a dollar I would try it. I got three of these little ornaments. I thought they were really cute. Like I said in a previous video, I do my Christmas tree in red and white. So these were so adorable. So I got three of them, the little snowman. And they got the little branch arms. I'm going to put them over there so they don't get broken. Now they had a bunch of wood, different wood stuff. Here's one of the trays I got. It's got the like opening for a little handle. Let me see how big this is. This is seven inches by five inches. So seven by five. And I got two of those. And then they had these little crates. Are these not so adorable? And these are, five by three yes five by three and I got let's see how many I get of those I got three of those I'm not sure exactly what I'm going to do with them but I thought maybe I could stack them or something use them for like this or use them for something small in my craft room they were just so cute I didn't want to pass them up now this is something that's been around it is the cutting boards I got two in red and two in white I 
I found these craft clamps. They're six piece. This is the only package I saw, or else I would have bought more of these. These are great for crafting. I wish um, they had more. Hopefully, they'll get more in. And then I found these square patty squares, and well, that was kind of repeated, right? Patty's paper squares is what I meant to say. There's a hundred sheets in here. They're five by five, and. I thought these might be good for when you're die cutting. I'm not sure, you know, how sometimes um, stuff gets stuck. I don't know. That just something that came to the mind when I saw those. So we'll see. And then they had carton sealing tape. And I don't know if this stuff um, goes bad after a while, the tape in general, because I have a bunch of it that several years ago, there was coupon you could get it free at Walmart and I stocked up a lot on it and every time the coupon came out it was a dollar off and they were a dollar at Walmart I just kept going and buying more and now they're kind of hard to use sometimes so I'm not sure if they go bad or if it's you know after a while if you know please post below and let me know if I'm wasting my time with them and then I got two of the heavy duty clamps these are the bigger size than the other ones now I found this garland here and it's got snowflakes all over it. I thought it was cute. It's 25 feet. And I see a lot of people are finding the um, um, the t like the twine looking one with the red berries. I have not seen that. I've been wanting to get those and I have not seen it. But this one here has, is on wire. Here's what it looks like by just, you know, without all bunched up. So I thought that was cute. I'll put that on something. And then I got this cotton twine, 320 feet. I got a two pack of electrical tape because I go through this when I'm making my tumblers. I got some of the cable ties. This is a 60 piece, they're eight inches. And then I got this woodwork glue. Now, to be honest with you, I don't know why I got this. Um, I started to get it, and then I didn't, and then I went back and got it because I have Gorilla Wood Glue. But I'm going to try this, see if it works. Just so if it, if it does work really good, then, you know, it'd be cheaper than buying the Gorilla Glue maybe. We'll see. This is only two ounces. So the Gorilla Glue is a bigger bottle, but I don't remember what I paid for it. Here's my receipt to show you how much I bought there. A lot of stuff. Okay, now I already showed you the plates, but now I saw a tray in the buffalo plaid, and it says it's the most wonderful time of the year. And let's zoom out there. And this is a good size tray. Let's see what the size is. It is 14 inches by 10 inches. So 14 by 10. I thought that was cute to add to my collection of um, plaid things, I, plates I bought. And then I got this e.l.f. I don't know. I don't think this e.l.f. is cute at all, but I got it because, you know, someone will come up with an idea to use this wreath or, or this form for something else. So that's why I picked one up. But it's not that he's ugly. I don't know. Maybe because they made them yellow. I think if they made them, you know, a different color or something. I don't know. It just it didn't really excite me, I'll say. Okay, let me grab a thing over here. Here's some more stuff. Then I got this pumpkin spice and all oh, the papers over. I gotta turn the paper. Pumpkin spice and everything nice sign. Well, this is two hauls in one, I guess, because I see an, another receipt here. And then I got this. Um, bow hair. I thought this would be really pretty for autumn. It says it's a Christmas one, but I don't know. The colors just, I thought, looked good with the autumn stuff. Okay, I bought a measuring cup. This is a four cup measuring cup. I got this for the dog food because we switch what we feed them now. So it's a, uh, we give them two and a half cups. So this makes it easier instead of guessing at the half a cup by the measuring cup I use now. Um, and then I found these beads, or glad pearl, glass pearls. Um, there's 135 pieces, and there's four different sizes. There's that one, this one, this one, and then the last one. So there's four different sizes in here. I thought those would be really cute to put on something. 
And then I got some tags. Um, these are the ones with the red cardinal. They say Mary, Noel. I guess maybe the other side says Christmas or something. I'm not sure. They may not. But I thought these were really cute. And I'm actually making some uh, ornaments with the cardinal on them for memorial ornaments. So I thought this would be perfect to use as the gift tag. And then I got these gift tags. And these I thought were just so cute. This one is all in blue and white. And it says winter wishes, let it snow, laughter and joy. Um, and then there's some the same ones on the back side. So there's 18. So there's two of each design. Uh, this one, because it has the red truck, has camper, poinsettias, Santa, and again, the same on the other side. And this one, it says Merry Christmas, has the dogs, penguins, uh, gingerbread, Santa, nutcracker, snowman. They're really cute gift tags, I think. And they also seem, oh no, they open up. So they're not just one-sided. They actually open up. You can write inside of them. I just noticed that because they noticed they were um, a little thick. But if you looked, well, I don't know if you're going to be able to tell, but all these, like the gingerbread, the snowman, the tree and stuff, on all of them, all the designs I just showed you, they're up a little. They're puffed up a little. So they're almost like they have a... Um, one of those dot things in between there. They probably do to lift them up. So it's not just a flat, uh, you know, print on there. It's actually added to the background. They're just really nice. Then I got some liquid adhesive. And I'm going to be trying this, <coughs> excuse me, I'm going to be trying this on a shirt because I have some uh, sequins on there that came loose. So I'm going to see if this works on there. It says it's perfect for embellishments, wood, plastic, leather, paper, cardboard, and trims. Actually, this isn't the one that I was thinking it was. It shows a hat there. That's why I was thinking um, fabric. It doesn't say it on there, but I'm going to try it. Or I might have bought some fabric one. We'll see. And then I got this glue and residue eraser. I love these things. I have one. I definitely didn't pay a dollar for it before. So I grabbed, I think, two of these. Yes, I grabbed two of these. And then I got two of these packages of magnets. There are 14 in each package. Okay, now they had a lot of different wood um, signs and picture frames, everything else. So I got this plaque. This would be nice to paint and put a saying on with my Cricut. And this one here is an arrow, but now that I'm looking at it, you could use it as a house too. Paint it as a house, just change the cord, but it is an arrow. And here is another arrow. This one is thinner and longer. Now, I bought three of these. Yes. I bought three. Oops, sorry. It's stuck. I bought three of these. And now, there's the wood. They have a little peg in the back to stick in the hole so they'll sit up. And then they got the heart cut out. And why I bought those is because I also bought two of these I think or let me see okay I just bought two, two of these um, I think because I thought it would be crazy to get one for each dog but I could do the three dogs together I got one with the dog here is what it looks like and I, it fit perfect on there you could glue it on and put a picture of your dogs in there I thought that would be really cute and then I also got one for the cat because we also have a cat and I thought that would be cute sitting on there they have some really cute wood things. <clears throat> Excuse me. And then I have um, this other wood sign. Oh, it's the same. Yes, it's the same size as that one. And I got this oval plaque. I got two of those. I got this plaque. I got two of those. And then I got one of these. Okay, so what I did was I bought the plaques to put things on. So I'm one of the three of these. 
I got one. I got a plaque that's or a, a wood sign that says love. And I'm thinking of gluing that on there. So I got one for the dog. I had the dog, one for the cat. And then this one I thought like we put a picture of my husband and I in there, our wedding picture or something, and put love on there. So that was one of the words. The other one was hello and or home, not hello, but home. And I just thought these would be nice on these plaques. You could paint them, put them on there. This one does say hello, or you could do hello on there. That's what the hello looks like, and this is what the home looks like. Okay, so that's the end of this haul. I have another haul, too, with some more craft items in it. But this one, if you stay tuned, I did take video and pictures of all the craft stuff they had. I was just shocked um, that th this particular store got so much of it in. So it's nice that they're doing this. I mean, you can't get these for a dollar anywhere else that I know of, unless you find them on clearance or something. And th they're good. I mean, they're. I wouldn't, if you push real hard, of course, they're going to crack in too. But they're a good thickness and stuff. They're not bad. So they had some nice scenes. They had other ones there. Like I said, I took pictures. So, so if you're interested, stay tuned to see the video and the pictures of the other items in the store. If you're not, this is the end of this haul. Thanks everyone for watching. Please click like and subscribe. And if you're a new subscriber, make sure you hit that bell so you always get notified when I post a new video. Until next time. Bye everyone.
avant qu'on voulait, avant que là. Fait que là, à mon avis, je sais pas qu'est-ce qu'il dit. Par la traite. Ah, il dit pas ça, là. On a jamais vu ça, là. Ah ouais. Ça fait bon, faut que je me le prenne, là. Mais moi, j'ai pas mis la fin de 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 la fin de